He dropped out of college and enlisted in the Coast Guard to save lives, not take them, he told his sister. He's the only member of the Coast Guard to receive a Medal of Honor in its over 200-year history. He was Signalman First Class Douglas Monroe, and during the Battle of Guadalcanal, he was in charge of 24 Higgins boats, engaged in a daring evacuation of Marines trapped at Point Cruz. Monroe volunteered to take four landing craft into enemy fire to attract their attention, while the other 20 boats evacuated the beleaguered Marines. They came under unrelenting fire, with 12 Coast Guardsmen losing their life, including Monroe, who died in his best friend Ray Evans' arms, his last words asking if they got the Marines off safely. Among the rescued Marines was future Medal of Honor recipient John Bassalone. Inspired by her son, Monroe's mother Edith enlisted in the Coast Guard's Women's Reserves where she would serve out the war. The two are buried side by side at Laurel Hill Memorial Park in Washington State.